I'm Kristen Rupenian, and I'm watching Young, Bold, and Regal. Hey, everybody. It's Evan Jackson. We're here at the Film Independent Spirit Awards, and we're here with... Kristen Rupenian and Olivia Lucy Phillip. How awesome is it to be here today, to be in this room celebrating films and being back outside to these amazing events? It is incredible. It's the first award ceremony I've ever been to, so I'm very thrilled. And we came in from Brooklyn, so being outside at all is a dream. Yeah, it's a, it's a joy. Really happy to be here and support Kristen and independent film. It's And to be on the beach. What? Beautiful. <laughs> what, what is a project that you're, you're working on that is a part of this award ceremony or something in the future um, for both of you? Oh, yeah. So I wrote this story for the movie Bodies, Bodies, Bodies. Um, and I also wrote a story called Cat Person that just um, premiered at Sundance. So I'm excited to see how people respond to that one. Yeah. I'm not involved in this particular award ceremony apart from accompanying my friend who is nominated. <laughs> but I also act and have done some TV and film. And, you know, here's hoping that the next thing gets us here too. <laughs> well, we love that you're here because it's about support. And a thing about Bodies, 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 how I heard about it was on social media. It was an incredible hit. Then I saw the trailer. Then I realized Pete, Pete Davidson was in the trailer about 45 <laughs> seconds or a minute in, and you see all of these stars that are either budding or people are just instantly tuned in. Yeah. So how was it to write that story and see it come to life with the Pete Davidson, with all these other starlets and the stars who are budding at the beginning of their career? I mean, I think the casting for that film was incredible. I did a wonderful job. It's trippy because I am significantly older than the characters in the film, but I originally, when I wrote the story, it was based on my friends. So we had an incredible text thread going back and forth where everyone wants to know, like, am I Pete Davidson? Am I Pete Davidson? Am I Pete Davidson? And I was like, you're all Pete Davidson. <laughs> yeah. What I love about the film also is the horror element, and I feel like horror has been mainstreamed more than ever. Um, how do you feel about to, uh, to be a part of this horror renaissance with your film, with Megan, with Note being a splash hit, being a part of this era where it's a genre within the genre? Well, I personally feel that the world is catching up to me. I have been a horror fan since I was forbidden to watch movies from by my parents. Um, but I love it. I feel like it just means that you can do more strange things. I think the thing about horror before was that like things got weird, but you had a pretty constricted frame you can work in, and now that people have seen how wild it can get, there's just more freedom and more audience, so it's great. It's a great Thank you so much. Yeah.